Hey, get out of here, creeper. I'm about to record a video. Get out. Get out. Leave me alone. Go away. Thank you. Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to give you a tutorial about how to make an automatic wheat farm. So this is what it looks like. And I did one over there too. And just pull the lever. Your water's going to come down. Push all the seeds and wheat up into here and you just grab them. So, pretty cool. And you just wire it however you want. And then I made one over here. Works perfect. Wire it however you want. Now, we're going to make one together. I don't know where though. <laughs> Let's, let's make it over here. This looks like a good place, right here. Okay, so you want to have these things on your hotbar. You want to make 12, a line of 12 wood. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, and 1, 2, 3. Double check. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six, seven, I'm just going to trust it. <laughs> okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. So then, you want to bring this out, but that, we'll do that later. So, you put a piston here, two blocks away, another piston, and two blocks away, another piston, one behind it. And end with one. There you go. So now we want to add another row of 12 behind it. Dang it. <laughs> and place. And then we want to put wood behind all the pistons. Like so. And then we want to add this but above the ground. So there you go. And make sure the repeaters are facing the pistons like this. And then you just add redstone to all of it. Alright. And then you put a redstone torch Oops, not here. Here. Ugh. So all the pistons will be on. Ah, okay. So you get your bucket of water, ice cream, <laughs> and you place one here, and then you place one here, and you do that for all of it. Make sure you put it in both spots in order. Probably not gonna work. There you go. So now we use half blocks and go eight down. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I might have to get out the way. Thank you. Just get rid of some of this grass. And then you just wanna make these. Like this, like so, and boom, boom. So, dang it, get away. And you can use any color wood, stone half steps, stone, anything. Any block, any half step you want to make it out of. If you're doing like a theme thing, like Nether Time with Nelson, I don't know, then you can make it Nether themed. Um, or you can make it Stone Brick if you want it all fancy. I'm just doing it like this. So, next thing you want to do is um add another 
block here and here and hollow out this and then get away grass mm, okay and then hollow out this 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 and it's right down the middle so let's check real quick if our water reaches all the way just knock the torch out make sure it reaches all the way and it stops all right good that is very good very good so i could close that now oops no there you go so i closed it and then you want to get a bucket of water place it here and here so when the things come down, it'll come into here, like this little seed is doing. And then, you actually need to knock out this, and put water in these two for your plants, or your crops. Same thing here. All of this out. And boom, boom. And boom, boom. Yay. And as you saw in the demonstration, all the wheat and everything will get knocked out. And then just close it and the water will come back in. I have one here, here, and there. They're pretty simple to make. And if you have a lot of resources, they shouldn't be that expensive to make either. So you can wire it up like this so you can control it from farther away from spot or you can just have it a different way thank you for watching and that was that will be all get 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 off no get away leave leave You're killing my crops. Ugh. Thank you.